Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I will be playing Invasion 2, Map 1, Awakening. This Megawatt is a bit special to me, because it was the first custom Megawatt I ever played. Invasion 2 was made by Paul Flechut and Rick Lipsy and released in 1998 as the sequel to The Invasion. It contains 32 new maps with custom textures and music made by Mark Clem. It's supposed to be a partial conversion mode with some custom enemies, as was the Invasion, but was never finished. So we have only a better version now. I never played the Invasion, but it was known for containing some things placement bugs. It was 98 after all, so I'm not even sure if we will be able to get all the kills and secrets in these levels. Also, the original Megawatt was really dark, so I increased the overall brightness on all levels in Doom Builder by like 50 to 60 units to make it a bit more YouTube friendly. And I also added some widescreen assets, like title screen and the status bar. I will attach the link to the patch in the description. And I also added, added a hacked patch with level names. I didn't comply with the original Doom level names lens, but anyway it should work in the limit removing source ports. And by the way, I'm back to this day Doom and it works here. Also these levels have some dubcute, to 98 I mean. Right, so let's start. The first level is... Awakening. Let's go. Let's go kill some zombies first. And now, as you can see, our spaceship has crashed, and now we are somewhere in the middle of nowhere. I already played the first level, selecting my next project. So I'm familiar with this one, but for the next levels, it was a really long time since I played this megawatt. So it will be like partially blind or semi-blind. So yeah, we can grab the green armor here. And let's go up here. We can press some switches and kill some hits come. Let's see. It's only zombies and imps in this level. Nothing too serious. It's the first level after all. Right, what do we have here? Some ruins and more zombies. Come on. And the first imp. Some bullets here. Right, and here we have the water pool. But nothing here, so we can just quit. And now we have one switch to press. Which should open a door in the other section, I think. Right. Pretty big open area here. Then let's go back and go for the other side. Have some steam pack. More zombies, of course. And I don't know that there is a secret here. It's not obvious. If you interact with this wall, you can get the chainsaw. Let's go chainsaw some stuff. Maybe some imps as well, somewhere. Yeah, this guy. Nice. And then we have more ammo here. Right. Then we need to go back and climb this wall again. And of course we need to go around. Right, and also nice music. I think pretty old one. I heard this soundtrack in other Megawatt as well. Right, and we have the light amplification goggles. They are not needed right now, because I added some brightness, but could be useful in the original version. So now we have the exit door, which requires the red key, and we're going to get one pretty soon. And I think I heard the door opened. Yeah, this one. So this is another secret, but I will not grab these light amplification goggles. Right, and then we have teleporter here, and now we can get the red key. Zuni River, or Zuni, I don't even know. Right, then let's grab the red key and go back. By the way, that was the one time to the potter line death, so if you go here again, you will soft lock yourself. Right, and I think that's it. Let's check the stats, and we got everything but one item. I'm not sure if I even go and look for it. Maybe it was the light amplification goggles. Let's see. Yes, right. Then we got everything. Let's go. That was Awakening, 
the first level of the Invasion 2. As I said, I used to play these levels quite a long time ago. I probably remember some of the levels, but most of them will be almost blind to me. We'll see what this Pinkabot throw at me. See you in level 2.